in the cup. Oh, uh -huh. god damn. What's good? Uh huh. Got your nigga in the. Okay, what's good? What's good? Got your nigga in the. Uh uh uh. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Toomey. Me. I'm not on the she kind though. I'm on my channel. Just be doing what I am. If for those of you who have noticed, my channel looks a bit different. There's a different title, you know. You know, it's usually the title of the video and then the she kind, but it's no longer called the she kind. It's just called Be Do My M after, of course, this girl right here. And yeah, just a bit of rebranding. Want to just, you know, zhuzh it up a bit, okay? Do something different for me. So it's no longer called the Shikaib, it's just called Bitumala M. And welcome back to my channel for those of you who are returning. Hey, welcome back. Thanks for tuning in again. And for those of you who are new, welcome. And I hope that you will hit the subscribe button down below. And as you can see by today's video title is about back to basics, the, really the basics of makeup. And I've been you know, playing with this idea in my mind for a bit of time. And I'm like, you know what, girl, stop self-doubting yourself, just do it. So this is gonna be a back to basics, back to basics, ooh, child. Back to basics video series that I'm gonna be doing. And as you can see in today's title, it's about the eyebrows. And I was hesitant to do the eyebrows, you know, a lot of people have actually asked me in my personal life, people who know me, not online, because y'all be coming for those people who be like, oh, who's asking? There are people who are asking me in my personal life, okay? So a lot of people have been asking me in my personal life, how do you do your eyebrows? Can you know, like, you should probably do, like do a video. I'm like, well, you know, people have watched me do my eyebrows on my channel before, but you know, they're like, yeah, maybe do something quite detailed so they know the steps. I'm like, you know, okay, cool. I just feel like everybody does the eyebrows so differently. You know, people do fluffy brows. People kind of just leave them natural. They don't use you. Some people are microblading because they don't have, you know, brow hairs. And so I just feel like everybody does their eyebrows so differently. Whatever floats your boat. And I feel like whatever looks good on you. And if you think the way that I do my eyebrows is pretty dope, this is the right video for you to watch. I start off with my eyebrows already trimmed and plucked or tweezed. And then I brush them into place with the Essence Make Me Brow Gel Mascara and the Color Brownie Brow. I don't use too much of the product because it does tint my eyebrows, but I just like to use this to put my eyebrows into place. I fill in my eyebrows with a Yardley Eyebrow Pencil in the color Woodburn. I make a line below and on top of my eyebrows and then make fine strokes with the pencil in between the hairs. I go back in with the Essence Make Me Brow Gel Mascara to diffuse the harsh lines of the pencil. I then go in with the Yardley Raincoat Mascara, it's invisible, water resistant and it's a top coat that sets and shapes lashes and eyebrows. So I basically use this to set my brows even further in place so throughout the day they won't move. I then go in with two concealers. I firstly use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the color 40. This is my highlight shade, so I place it underneath my eyebrows. I apply it in small dots, not to use too much concealer at first. I will build up on the concealer later on in the video. I blend it in with a Carla concealer brush that I got from Diskin.
Slowly building up the concealer underneath my eyebrows is quite important to give my eyebrows an arch. My eyebrows are quite different. One of them doesn't really have an arch. The other one does have a bit of an arch. So this makes them more consistent and even. I then place the LA Girl HD Pro Concealer on my hand. And this is in the color Fawn. It's most closest to my skin tone. And I apply it on top of my brows to clean up and give them shape. I go in with the same color concealer brush. It's really important to take your time blending and concealing on top of your eyebrows, blending right into the forehead. This is why I use a concealer that's closest to my skin tone. Blending beneath the eyebrows is quite easy because you can blend it onto your eyelids to already prep and prime your eyelids for eyeshadow. I really take my time at the top to make sure that I don't place any concealer on the actual eyebrow and I make sure to go right to the bottom of the eyebrow. If I feel like I haven't sort of done a good enough job with the color concealer brush because it's quite big, I then go in with a small angled brush for very accurate lines. This is a really great brush to have in your collection. When I'm done with the small angled brush, I then go in with a blending sponge just to buff it out and make sure it's all fine and even and there's no harsh lines. I think this is really helpful as well. Even though I'm going to apply foundation on top of it, I just like to do this to make sure it's all blended and even. And that is it. That is how I do my eyebrows. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.